Hey guys, welcome back, it's Ari from EntermedSchool.com. Today we are going to talk about cell junctions and the thing you should remember for specifically for the IMAT exam. So, we have mainly three types of cell junctions. Tight junctions. Desmosomes. And gap junctions. For the IMAT exam, you will have to remember that tight junctions, as their name suggests, are a tight seal between two cells that will not allow water, ions, or any other small molecules to go through between the cells. We need this type of junctions in places where you can't allow things to go through, like the bladder, for example, the urinary bladder, or the kidney, or some places in the intestine. You can't allow water and molecules to go through to the other side from the cells, from the tissue. The second type of cell junction is desmosome. Desmosomes are not tight, but they do hold cells together. Usually you can find them in places that a lot of stress is applied on, like the skin for example. Water ions can pass through the desmosomes. Gap junctions are some sort of tunnels between the cells and you can usually find them in cells that require the use of action potential and electrical coupling. For example, Cardiac muscles or heart muscles require the passage of ions and elect electrical coupling in order to work. So ions can pass from one cell to another and other small molecules.